Welcome to the Lux Blog NC YouTube channel. I am so excited today to be joined by the founder of the Bull City Music School, Miss Hopkins. Yay! Yay! My star as well. So we're going to be talking to her today about her school and what makes it so amazing and what we can capture next for 2019. So tell me a little bit about what made you find yeah. Bull City Music School. Well. Really, I was just destined to do it. Um, I started playing piano when I was five years old, and it's just stayed with me. I remember being in my living room, lining up all of my dolls, and having pretend <laughs> recitals, nice. and teaching them, and I just knew that I wanted greater control cool. over the creativity and knowing what the students were going to learn. Okay. Um, I spent about eight years in the classroom, okay. and I taught in Texas, Florida, and Tennessee, wow. and then I did my student teaching in Mississippi. After being in all of those different settings, I knew that there was a problem with our music education ecosystem, right. and ecosystem is the word that I use because in whenever you have a system, it's more than just one being to keep right, it to keep it all going to be, exactly to keep it going. And I said, "There's a huge disparity here." Mm. And I said, "Wait a minute, we got to do something." Right. And music is always last hired, first on the chopping block. So I said, "Once again." got to do something because that happened to me. Mm -hmm. I was hired in May and by October I was gone. There was no more music education at the schools. And knowing that how life-changing it can be for students, I said whenever I'm in the position that I'm going to open my own school and make music accessible because music lessons are formally, you know, they're only accessible to the middle and upper class. Right. But we have so many talented students whose families can't afford it. Right. So how do I answer the call? How do I eradicate this disparity that's in music ed? Right. And here I am with the first step at Bull City Music School. That is amazing. Yeah. I am so glad that you have this beautiful school here because it's opened the doors for kids here in the Bull City in Durham, North Carolina. And I'm just happy to be able to have an opportunity to talk to you about it. So now what can we expect next for 2019? Wow. It's so, almost here. I know, I know, I can't believe it. Right. So really what's next for 2019 is we're going to continue expanding. Okay. So currently we offer classes for adults. Okay. We offer classes for babies. Awesome. And we offer classes for the in-between. So Ooh, nice. starting with the babies, there's music garden classes. Mm -hmm. So we're going to expand. So right now we just offer classes for the babies. Okay. Um, Babies and toddlers, so then next we're going to expand to preschool. Okay. And then from there, when they're ready to move into formal lessons, mm -hmm. we're going to continue adding instruments. So right now we have piano, violin, viola, trumpet, saxophone, flute. Did I say guitar? If not, we have guitar. <laughs> uh, we offer percussion. Mm -hmm. And under percussion, melodic percussion is involved there. So we have a student that is taking marimba lessons. Oh, nice. And then we have drum set, so two different types. And voice lessons. So expansion plans, we are going to expand our camps. We okay. hosted our first drumline camp, which was held on the campus of North Carolina Central. Yeah. And we're going to um, <laughs> offer the camp again, mm -hmm. which was for middle school and high school students. Okay. Great. This year it's going to become residential. Okay. We had so many calls coming from out of the area for our camp wow. that it was like, we need a place to stay, we need a place yeah. to stay. So we're going to work with North Carolina Central to make that happen. Okay. So we're expanding um, our drumline camp. And we are going to add a piano and violin camp this summer. So nice. education in the summertime. That is awesome. And I love yes. this beautiful piano yes. you have here. <laughs> <My baby. laughs> I yes. love it. Well, thank you so much. Yes. And please tell us where we can follow you. So a couple of places you can follow us. On Facebook, Bull City Music School. Then you can go on Instagram, Bull City Music School. And you can find us on Twitter at Bull City Muse, M-U-S-E. Thank you. Yes. Okay, let's approach it this way. So it is what was poured into me when I was going to college in Mississippi and now living in North Carolina. I'm pouring into the next crop of music education majors. 
Hi, it's Kimberly with the Lux Blog. I am so excited to be here at Bull City Music School. This is one of her fabulous instructors. Please introduce yourself. I'm Christopher Martin, the guitar instructor here. Yeah, so Christopher, I wanted to know what's it like teaching at Bull City Music School? It's fantastic. I think we've got the uh, the best students uh, and uh, and a great curriculum and, and, and great teachers and uh, it's been fantastic. Awesome, awesome. So if you could play guitar for anyone, who would it be? Oh, like in any musical group? Any musical genre or group. Oh, okay. Um, I guess I would play with... Um, uh, I don't know. How about Bruno Mars? Oh. Let's go big. I'd be in Bruno Mars' is back. I love it. I yeah. love it. That's one of my favorites. There you too. go. So, in a very fun tour. So, yeah. that is awesome. Well, how long have you been playing guitar? I've been playing the guitar for, oh man, maybe 20 years. Wow, yeah. nice. Yeah. So, what type of guitar do you play? I play uh, acoustic and electric guitar. Cool. Yeah. So did my dad. Okay, yes. excellent. Yeah. He played with Betty Wright, and he really no enjoyed way. playing acoustic and electric guitar. Wow, so, fantastic. Yes, and bass. Yeah. <laughs> so he was all over the place. Yeah. Well, that is awesome. Well, thank you so much for letting me chat with you of just course. a little bit today. Yeah. And thanks again. You got it.